All right, guys, today is Thanksgiving Day. Yes, you heard that properly, Thanksgiving Day. Me and her don't, are not doing anything for Thanksgiving. So, we're going to a local community lake because we knew nobody else would be here. Uh, we just had two inches of rain two days ago, so this is about the only place we could come that ain't blown out. Everything's severely flooded, so... We're going to fish for crappie, pickerel, and largemouth. And uh, enjoy the weather a little bit while it's nice. Right now it's in the upper 50s. Next week, every night gets down in the mid-20s, 25 to 28 degrees, with highs of only 45 to 48 the entire week. So <coughs> this is the last trip. This year that I'll probably use the regular fishing tactics I'm using now before I go to finesse vertical jigging and the fish go to their wintering spots, especially in the rivers. So after this, I'll strictly be doing crappie picker on walleye until March. Um, hopefully a lot of walleye fishing, but if it's like last year, I'll never be able to go because it rains so much here during the winter months but hopefully not this year it's gonna rain again sunday so today and tomorrow is the only nice days out of the four day weekend we got saturday and sunday is going to be cold and it's going to stay cold it looks like you done here? yeah all we got to do is get your two poles He's moving gravel. He's moving that gravel pile. There we go. All right. It's gotta be a crappie. Yeah, oh, oh! The minnow, Bobby Garland? The one that's plain minnow? All right, guys, first fish of the day. I got him on the Bobby Garland minnow. It's just a silver. And gray, really dull, with a little hint of pink is purple. Nice, man, these are better than the ones that, look at that. Oh, man. That's that snag I was telling you about. Nice Thanksgiving crappie, guys, wow. He's only about 10 inches, but he's real tall and real thick. My goodness. That's what I'm talking about. Nice crappie. Wow. Made it worth coming already. Now if I, I was just saying I've never caught a crappie in this lake, but I had a buddy that has, and she's had one on and we've seen it. Finally got my first crappie out of here. Nice black. Boy, they are pretty in here because this water's so clear. Hey. Remember I threw him the pliers and they fell in the water? <laughs> the one I bought the catfish weights from in Poplar Bluff. Him and his wife were here and you fished on the bank with her. Me and him came out here in the canoe. You don't remember that? There we go. Oh man, that's another nice one. Whoa, oh, it's a pickerel. Oh guys, I got a pickerel on four pound line. I better let him wear down. This is the pole I was hoping not to get a pickerel on because it, they can easily bite through this. I mean, real easy. All right, yes. Little 12, 13, 14 inch pickerel. Oh man, I'm gonna have to retie my jig. He swallowed it. They're biting that good. He inhaled this thing. I'm gonna have to cut the line. Look at that. Way down his throat. Oh my God. I don't know if I can get that. be hard this little mm, nice little chain pickerel 
I wish I could get him washed off, but I know he'll get away if I try to wash him. Can you... Zoom if you have to. Nice little picker. I'd say he's about 14. 13 or 14. A little dirty. I had to cut the line on this guy. It was so far in there I would have risked killing him if I tried to get it out. I'm just going to have to tie a new jig on. snot rockets they are slimy they are the one of the slimiest fish they're worse than a catfish you got one Oh man, it's a big pickerel. All right, good job, Wilma. Let him wear down. That's a that's a decent one. He's 17. Oh man. All right, Wilma got a nice chain pickerel. I guess it was. See, now you glad we came here? You don't get to catch many pickerel, really. I always seem to get the pickerel, and you don't. Know, but you finally got a nice one. That's a decent one for here. Yeah. She caught him on a gold flaked clear gold flaked Bobby Garland of all things they're biting real small baits today guys they won't hit a crankbait they ain't hitting my swim bait neither every fish we've caught all three have been on Bobby Garland maybe that's the black things I was seeing maybe that's what I was seeing swimming around that's the biggest one I've seen out of here to be honest that's the best picker I've seen come out of this lake man yeah he's He's easily 18, actually. He's 18 or 19. Hold him up for us. Man. Yeah. Okay, turn him. There you go. Man, that's a nice one. Try to close his mouth a little bit. Like, I mean, no, I mean, hold its, hold its, your hand under its mouth so it ain't so big. Where I can see the whole fish. Okay. <sighs> Come this way. No. Yeah, there you go. Now try to close its mouth some. It looks funny. Try to put your hand underneath here where it's. No, like that. You're not understanding. It looks real skinny and then it's got a giant mouth. I can put your hand. Hold your other hand right here. Okay. Hold hold the fish different. Oh, that was a big fish just jumped. I heard a fist jump. No, that's a duck. Oh, yeah. I can't hold like that. No, but you can you can quit from prying its mouth. Now you're way over there again. Come this way and hold it straight. There you go. Yeah. Okay, stand up a little better. Or set up a little better. There you go, like that. That's fine, just like that. Let me get a good picture of you. Oh, hold on a little longer. That's a nice pickerel there, honey. Okay. Good job. <laughs> she was just saying that she was wish she'd went somewhere else. Uh, now what? You wouldn't have got none of them in here at the other place. Get it. Hold it. Ah. You hold the fish. No. That's a decent pickerel though, I'm telling you. That's a nice one. Where'd he bite actually? Just on the edge of those lilies? He's the best one I've seen come out of here. guys that ends this day we only caught three fish the quality was there out of two on two out of the three fish 
she got her nice picker when I got that nice crappie other than that it was very slow it's from unstable weather like I said we just had two inches of rain the night before last and it was warm for a whole week pretty much every day even at night and then all of a sudden it got down in the 30s last night so it's been very cold just cold out of nowhere and all that rain didn't help uh, at least we did get two nice fish though and we're still learning this lake we don't know how to fish it properly yet we've only been here about I think this was our fourth time third maybe third or fourth and uh, we just don't know the features of it but we're learning it's a there ain't much there ain't many characteristics to this lake there's no brush hardly at all except in very shallow water lots of plants and there's not many features except one slight tiny cove here other than that just kind of a bland lake uh, but anyway guys till next time hit that like button and please subscribe